Some cars are fast, some are fuel efficient, and some are difficult to find. If the history of cars teaches us anything, some of the finest models ever created were produced in limited numbers, adding to their demand, status, and present worth. While Mercedes-Benz typically produces its cars in high volumes, it has built several rare models over the years. So in this video, we will look at the top 10 rarest Mercedes cars ever made. Before we start with our list, please give this video a big thumbs up, and don't forget to subscribe to the channel with notifications on. Number 10. Mercedes-AMG G63 6X6, 100 units. As the name indicates, the G63 6X6 is a six-wheeled version of the G-Wagon built to conquer the toughest terrains. It comes with a mighty twin-turbo V8, six-wheel drive, and 18 inches of ground clearance. With state-of-the-art suspension and differentials, it could declare war on just about any terrain the driver pleases. It even has a tire pressure control system built in, so you don't have to leave the luxury of the cabin to air up or down on soft sand. Number 9. Mercedes Maybach G650 Landolet, 99 units. If you think it looks like the AMG G636X6 with an axle missing, you're correct. Mercedes made a 4X4 version and lifted it even higher, while extending the wheelbase by 22.8 inches to create the ultimate luxury off-roader for the 1%. The back of the roof is converted to a power-operated soft top, and underneath it is the first-class cabin-style rear seats from the S-Class. That's not enough absurdity for our more prosperous and betters, though, so under the hood is a 621 horsepower twin-turbo V12 engine. Number 8. SALOR McLaren Sterling Moss, 75 units. In the early 2000s, Mercedes-Benz owned a 40% stake in McLaren, making it easy for the two companies to work together. Mercedes-Benz built several versions of the SLR McLaren, and the Sterling Moss is arguably the best. The SLR Sterling Moss was built in honor of a legendary F1 racing driver of the same name and had a unique speedster body style. Technically speaking, the SLR Sterling Moss inherited the best genes of the SLR family and consequently offers a unique driving experience for all of the senses. The SLR still has a massive V8 under the hood, but thanks to its body style and carbon fiber construction, it's much faster. It can hit a top speed of 217 miles per hour, making it one of the fastest cars of the 2000s. Number 7. Mercedes-Benz AMG Hammer Coupe, 30 units. Mercedes-Benz's tuning division has built many iconic cars over the last three decades or so. However, this would probably have never happened had it not been for the 1988 AMG Hammer, as it was the first Mercedes-Benz model AMG ever worked on. The AMG Hammer was a sports sedan based on the W124, and it was fantastic. With a 5.6-liter V8, dishing out 360 horsepower. It's clear why the AMG Hammer is often included on the list of European muscle cars. Number 6. Mercedes-Benz CLK GTR, 28 units. This car wasn't really designed as a road car. AMG and Mercedes-Benz built it with the track in mind. The CLK GTR was built with total domination in mind. As you would expect of a race car, the Mercedes-Benz CLK GTR came with loads of aerodynamic features. The car's chassis is made of carbon fiber and aluminum honeycomb monocoque, while the interior has carbon fiber and Alcantara finishings. Under the hood is a monstrous V12 propelling it. As per homologation regulations, Mercedes-Benz built 28 road-legal CLK GTRs and sold them for $1.5 million each. Number 5. Mercedes-Benz C111, 16 units. The wedge-shaped show car features Colt wing doors. The C111 is finished in a shade of bright metallic orange. It is a dream sports car with a Weinkel rotary engine. With three rotors that displace 600 cubic centimeters each, the Weinkel engine of the C111 develops 276 horsepower. Wrapped in glass-reinforced plastic and joined by adhesive bonding and riveting, 
The aero-focused body shell of the C111 enables a top speed of 260 km per hour, while 0 to 100 km per hour takes 5 seconds. Number 4. Mercedes-Benz W196 Silver Aero, 14 units. The W196 was one of the most successful racing cars of its time. The car, in its fully carried out version, looked totally stunning, a type of vehicle never seen before. The aerodynamic advance was remarkable with respect to its rivals. It competed in the 1954 and 1955 Formula One seasons, winning 9 of 12 races and 2 world championships. In 2013, Bonham sold one of these vehicles for nearly $30 million, which is the second largest sum for a car at auction in history. Number 3. Mercedes-Benz AMG Vision Gran Turismo, 5 units. Vision Gran Turismo is a project in which the world's automakers and global brands develop a concept car for the fans of Gran Turismo. The car that crowns the opening of this innovative collaboration is the Mercedes-Benz AMG Vision Gran Turismo. The real model was created on November 20, 2013. The frame of the car is made of aluminum pipes, the body is made of carbon fiber, and a removable spoiler was installed at the rear. A 580 horsepower V591 by turbo engine was installed as a power unit. The interior design, especially a number of controls and seats, is inspired by Formula One cars. The instrument panel is equipped with futuristic elements. The floating information panel made of glass is located above the steering wheel. Number 2. Mercedes-Benz 300 SLR Uhlenhaupt Coupe, 2 units. Mercedes-Benz is no stranger to the motorsport scene, as it has built some of the greatest race cars of all time. One such car is the 300 SLR, which dominated the racing scene in the 50s, winning the 1955 Mil Miglia in the hands of Sterling Moss. Mercedes-Benz built only two road-legal examples of the 300 SLR called the Uhlenhaupt Coupe, with more sculpted bodies and gullwing doors. The Uhlenhaupt was by far the fastest road car in the world when it was produced, capable of hitting speeds of over 180 miles per hour. One of these cars is on display at the Mercedes-Benz Museum, while the other shattered the record for the most expensive car ever sold when a private collector bought it for an eye-watering $142 million. Number 1. Mercedes-Benz 230 SL Pininfarina Coupe, 1 unit. Although the Mercedes-Benz 230 SL Coupe is today universally known and loved for its concave roof, which earned it the nickname Pagoda, the verdict was not in yet when it was launched at the Geneva Motor Show in 1963. In order to provide an altogether more exclusive option, Mercedes-Benz commissioned Italian Carrozzeria Pininfarina to create a design for the 230 SL Coupe of their own, while retaining enough of the original lines to make the car instantly recognizable. It's impossible to compare this car to any other. As this is the sole example in existence, it was a passion project from the Italian coach builder, who simply wanted to experiment with German-made vehicles while retaining their core features. This brings us to the end of today's video, so if you enjoyed this video, please give it a big thumbs up, and if you are new to this channel, don't forget to subscribe to this channel with notifications on, because we regularly upload new and exciting content.